Millions of people with MS do look for new and improved alternative therapies to treat their symptoms. We wanted to send her for an alternative therapy. We sent her to a holistic integrative MD to see which alternative therapy might help her. I practice holistic and integrative medicine. We use a lot of natural remedies in this practice, but we work hand in hand with the conventional docs. One of the things I really want you to do is to work with your diet. Eat organic because you want to reduce any pesticides, hormones, metals that might be in the food. Fish oils, calm inflammation. Fish oils would be very important for you. I would definitely be willing to try that. Exercise is very important with moderation. Don't let yourself just get stagnant. The last time I did it, my whole entire hand went numb. You want to be careful about generating too much body heat. So saunas are not a good idea for you. Hot tubs are not a good idea for you because that can actually bring about flares. I'm open to anything that will make me feel better. What I'd like to do now is I want to do a physical exam on you and then after that we would also want to give you intravenous IV infusion of vitamin C and glutathione. The vitamin C is an antioxidant, but it also helps to support the immune system's proper functioning. Glutathione is an antioxidant that helps protect you against inflammation. These are all part of a more holistic approach. I'm really looking forward to starting and, and trying to feel better. And um, I think that I'm on my way. How was your experience? It was great. It was nice to learn about the different ways you can treat it and what you can change in your everyday life to make things better and easier. And that's the most important thing is every day you can take action on your own, being active, eating a healthy diet. And everyone has a different course with MS, so that's why it's good to have a doctor involved who's an expert in the area who can help advise you about uh, how things are going and keep monitoring what's going on. And Debbie, best of luck to you. Thank